Good morning, guys. It is Saturday, August, August 3rd, I believe, and I just, it's not even, it's like 11 o'clock, it's not even morning anymore. But I just got done with a Skype call with some of my clients. Um, I'm starting to do like group Skype calls once a week and it's really, really fun to connect with my clients and like be able to like talk to them um, because it's online training and I don't really get to like connect with them as personally as I would like to. So it's really fun to do that. And so I just got done with that. I am about to have my meal of chicken and butternut squash and James and I are about to head down to the pool. I'm excited. It hasn't been sunny here in so long and so I've been like craving sunshine and so we're gonna go to the pool and read and just enjoy it and relax and that's what's up for the day. Guys, we are now done at the pool. It was amazing. It was so relaxing and it got a lot of good reading in. And so now James and I are about to head to the gym. Today I'm doing a power day and I'm going to do a commentary over the footage and let you guys know kind of what that means and what I'm including into my workout routine. So let's go. Hey guys, like I said, I went to the gym today and did a power day. And the reason why I'm incorporating this is because I want to get stronger and these compound exercises are also a great way to burn more calories during your workout while also getting stronger. And so I started the workout with barbell deadlifts. I did five sets of four reps with 135 pounds. And this is actually like a lot of weight for me because I just started doing deadlifts. Um, and my back is still so sore, but I'm really, really excited to continue getting stronger with deadlifts. It's something I've always wanted to do, but I've been afraid because I didn't want to get injured. Um, but I think I am at a good place to start incorporating them and to get stronger. And yeah, so the second movement was barbell overhead press. And I'm only using the bar here because I am not that strong with this movement. Um, I did 8 to 10 reps and I did 5 sets of this as well. So it was more of a volume, but I just wanted to see kind of where I'm starting out with with my strength and I also didn't want to push it too hard. This movement uses a lot of your core and so it's really important that you're not using a lot of weight to start out with um, so that you're having proper form and you're not using too much of your back. Um, you're not like hyperextending, stuff like that. So that's why I just did some lower weight to kind of see where my base starting point is. Um, and that was the power movements that I did. It took about 30 minutes and then I went to some accessory movements because I'm trying to hit my each body part twice a week. And so this was the day that I decided to hit back. Um, and so I did this hammer strength mid row machine, which I absolutely love. It like hits your lats so well and I like doing it just single hand to really isolate each one. The second accessory movement I went to is was actually a superset and I don't exactly know what these are called. It's like a cable pull lat thingy. It's not a close grip pull down or a straight arm lat pull down. It's kind of in between but I love it and it just like it provides such a great stretch and it's just one of my favorite back movements and so I did this and I supersetted that with some rear delt raises to again hit my back and I believe I did four sets of both of these um, accessory movements and so that was the lift I want to say it lasted about an hour but because I did the compound exercises it burned a lot more calories than I normally do during my lifts and so I didn't have to do as many movements um, then after our workout, we decided to go outside and do the sleds because we've never had that in a gym before. So we're really excited to like incorporate that stuff. Um, but it was so hard and you can see how much I'm struggling with that 45. I took it off and tried to do like one more set and that's literally all I did. <laughs> but that was the workout. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll talk to y'all soon.
enjoyed it and enjoyed the commentary.